Hey everyone, Santana Guy here, and welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. Give me a shark. <laughs> Holy heck. And welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories Reverse Rebirth. In the last episode, we took on Zexion, who was proven to be quite one of the most unique and kind of difficult boss, mostly because he kept stealing my cards. And I lost him three times. After that, due to a glitch in this game where you kept out a little whoosh, 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 kind of sound, um, I had to end the video right there because there's no way in heck I'm going to have that sound keep going, especially in the cutscenes. And yeah, and not only that, not only that, we discovered what happened to Destiny Islands. Due to Riku's actions, he caused Destiny Islands to be swallowed by the darkness. I understand why Riku wanted to go see the outside world, but he put a lot of his good friends in harm's way. But he is, looks like he's willing to, however, accept the actions that he had caused and try to learn from his mistakes. Not like that, Riku is no longer afraid of the dark, nor does he shine away from the light. He now walks in between. Anyway, enough about that little backstory, let's continue on. What is he? No one's ever worn the darkness the way that he does. It's impossible. <gasps> oh, yes, the replica, of course. We can use this Riku to defeat the real one. Axel? Wouldn't you like to be real? All you need is the kind of power that the real Riku doesn't have. If you can get that, you can be a new person, not Riku, nor anybody else. You won't just be a copy of someone, you will be unique, your own self. Axel! What are you saying to him? You know, he's as good a place to start as any. You can't do this! So sorry, Zexion. <laughs> you just found out way too much. Riku. Riku. Who's there? I know you can feel it. The grip that I have on your heart. Huh? You have led in the darkness, Riku. That means very soon your heart shall become an all-consuming darkness. I'm not like that now. Yes, you are. No! Can't move! The deeper the darkness runs inside you, the stronger I become. Controlling you is effortless. <laughs> Must you interfere again? Yeah. <sighs> Ooh, sure glad I made it in time. I gotta keep Ansem busy for a while. Huh? 
sorry I couldn't come here sooner, Riku. Your Majesty, is it you? Uh-huh. Whoa! <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> this time, you're not an illusion. I'm so glad that you can make it here. I made a promise to you that I would find a way, didn't I? Oh. Ah, uh, I'm okay. Don't worry. Guess I'm just relieved. I've... I've been alone so long that having someone else around is... is a little... overwhelming. But, uh, how did you make it here? I thought it was too far. I found a card to help me. I needed a way out of the realm of darkness. And then suddenly this card appeared right in front of me. When I picked it up, I could see your heart beyond the darkness. That's what let me find you. I guess the card thought its place was to be with you. Maybe you were right. And once again, Ansem has been forwarded once again, but not for long. It'll only be a matter of time before he comes back to try to take over Riku. Not only that, we got to see the replica Riku again, and killed Zexion. And there's one thing I still question, um, about that scene. I don't still don't know what Axel means by that Zexion knows too much. I don't, I don't understand that one bit. Maybe someone in the future can tell me why, if they at least know know how or why. Um, Axel says that, uh, please let me know in the comments so that way I can have a better understanding. But not only that... Oh, oh, oh boy! Time to kick some prayers, Mickey Mouse! Oh, oh. That's right, King Mickey is finally with us, and this time, he is no illusion. A power, a power of light should keep that some locked up for a while. I think the more I get, the more and more I get used to Mickey Mouse, the more I get somewhat sound like him. Anyway, we have one card left. Technically second to last. Twilight Town. We've been here as Sora. And now, it's Riku's turn. Also, can I say this right now? I'm gonna say this right now. Look at the bit, look at the left of the card, where you see another little planet right next to it. Why is that there? Uh, yes, context-wise, story-wise, story context-wise, story context excuse me. I know why it's there. But for someone who has not even played K the next game, they're gonna have no clue what that is. It's it feels like it's so out of place and not really. It feels like it it does not need to be there. But again, this game came out. This remake, excuse me, the remake at least came out before Kingdom at be after Kingdom Hearts sometime after Kingdom Hearts two. Sorry about my wording. <laughs> anyway. That's uh, my only little complaint right there for this card. Let's just go ahead and get into it. Where am I? What is this place? Oh, your majesty? You must battle me all alone. Against my dark powers. <laughs> huh. 
What's this? Are you giving up? Finally ready to surrender to your fate? You're not the true Ansem. Oh. Mm. Your scent is different. The Ansem in my heart smells darker. The odor is more foul. But... Your scent just isn't that. It's not darkness. It's something else. I finally understand. You're the one who guided me, when it started. You came to me pretending to be Ansem. You gave me the card. To make me face the darkness. Hmm. That, that is, is correct. correct. It is, or so I am known. You, I've watched you all along. Really? Who are you? And what do you want from me? For you to choose. Choose? You are a special entity. You exist between light and dark. You stand in the twilight. You are to meet Namine, then choose. Namine? Who's that? You will know soon. So, we're dealing with Ansem and Diz. Story reasons I can't say completely about Diz because, again, there's always bound to be that one person that does not know about the story. And since I'm playing the games based off the... Not based off... Well... Like, in between the story and, and release dates. But, for context-wise, he's... Diz is by far one of the most important characters. But, like I was trying to say... Diz... Was with us all along. However, the Anthem that we have been seeing... Is the real one. The one that we, the one that helped us to get out of that dark realm, to get out of that little, um, out of the realm of darkness, that was Diz that helped us. God, that attack is so powerful. And, once again, we're back. Twilight Town. I would say I am definitely um, looking forward to playing Kingdom Hearts 2, but because of story reasons, obviously. Ooh, yep, I'll definitely increase my attack power again. Uh, but because of how Square wants you to play the games. My goodness. Okay, for that little Harlston to interrupt me right there. Pots? Pots? Come here, Pots! <laughs> okay, back to what I was saying. Um, now, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, something about Diz. It was thanks to Diz that got us into Castle Oblivion. But who is Diz, though? What does he want with Rishu? From what we can gather, he says he wants us to meet Namine, the girl who meddled with Sora's memories. And when we see her, we have to choose something. However, I'm sure that's not the only person we're going to be seeing again. I'm sure we're going to be seeing a certain someone. Speaking of that, someone I need to see the world map. Oh, interesting. Let's see. I, th you know what? This would be a. Ah, dang it! No, it's not. Mm. 
I'll use this. Since we're seeing uh, two doors that... Thank you, Heartless, for getting in the way. By the way, yes, I'll be doing um, the entirety of Twilight Town in one video, just like I did with Sora. I love that attack. Unless I'm dealing with Ariel. Ariel Winston, that's a different story. Get rid of these guns for second air, heartless. Air rare, heartless, excuse me. That's why I can only deal with soldier heartless and shadows. Jeez! What? Oh, got out of my dark form. I know the way to the, um, to B2F is by going this direction, but we gotta also go in this direction. Actually, you want know to never mind, I'm not going to, um, do Twilight Town 1V. I'm gonna do, uh, it in two separate videos. Well, we'll see. Good thing I got the Joker. Maybe Naminé is here. Hold it! <laughs> You've changed. Your own darkness. It doesn't frighten you anymore. How can you tell? Because I'm you. No, I'm me. I'm me, he says. Must be nice being real. A fake like me could never get away with saying that. That's right! I'm a phony! A fake! The way I look, the way I feel, everything I remember! And even... this newfound power! Huh? I thought by finding some new strength, I could finally be someone, someone who's not at all you! But nothing changes. I'm still just empty! <gasps> Everything about me is borrowed. As long as you're around, I'll never be more than a shadow! Oh boy. Here we go. Riku versus Replica Riku. Oh, he's gonna spam that. Oh god, oh god. Oh yeah, I sure all did. God, I'm dead. Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh, that's what I get for charging in like a dumb idiot. Okay, I'm back, so let's um get, get the far in there. Come on! 
card, um, Jafar's card, is kind of broken. I just now realize how broken it kind of is. And I got a free level up from that. Let's see, I'm going to increase my dark power again. So, it's over. <laughs> Death doesn't frighten me. Good riddance to a phony life. My heart was never real. I'm sure even what I'm feeling now is probably all fake. What are you feeling? What happens when a fake dies? One like me. Where will my heart go? Does it disappear? It'll go somewhere. Maybe to the same place as mine. <laughs> A faithful replica until the very end. That's okay. Poor replica Riku. All he wanted to be is someone, but he couldn't be it. be anyone. In the end, he's no more. But maybe, just maybe, that he's in the side of Riku's heart, where they're both connected. Okay, so our objective right now is to, um, get to the end, meet Nominate, and that's where I will end up the video. Maybe get into, like, a battle or two, because I wreck. Because, hey, the more I experience I gain, the stronger I get. I just need to figure out where... Actually, you know what? No, I actually know where I'm going to end up the video. Okay, so I need a zero... A, a zero equal. Oh, please don't make me use those marsh or the dark room. You know what? Why am I me? Those barrel heartless right there. Eh, they should be simple enough to take down. Unless they can break from my car to get a chance to. There we go. Ow. That hurt quite a bit. Okay, let's see. I'm two rooms behind. Okay, skipping that fight, because I did not want to be in that one. I mean, heck, like... Okay, so here's what I'm going to do from now on. Especially if I choose 
to do um, Chain of Memories again on the GBA. Um, if I hit a Heartless, I'm going to be leaving that in... I'm going to be leaving that in the recording. If I'm trying to run away and I get myself caught into one, that will be skipped. Okay, fine with these guys being a little weaker. Oh, that's Rouse too behind. <sighs> wow. This still looks so beautiful. And it still looks so incredible to look at. Dang it! I'm getting the I'm getting the feels now. I think I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna see a grown man cry. <laughs> okay, here we are. Let's go see this. Let's go see Nominee again. But this time, as Riku. Getting rid of all this. Are you Naminé? Yes. I see. That was you. Huh? Forget it. Nothing. Please, come this way. Huh? Sora! What have you done to Sora? Nothing. He's just asleep. To get his memory back. So, Sora chose to forget about this castle, and get his old memories back? You have a choice to make, too. Why me, too? No one's messed with my memories. It's not your memories. It's your darkness. In your heart there is darkness, and in that darkness is Ansem. He may be at bay for now, but eventually he'll wake. And he will take over you just like he did before. But I have powers you can use. With my powers, I can put a tight lock on your heart. That way, Ansem could never come out from inside you. What happens to me if I let you do that? Will I forget? Everything? Like Sora? I'll have to. The darkness in you will be sealed tight just like your memory. You'll stop remembering the darkness. You'll go back to how you were. Riku, please choose. He doesn't even look worried. Will I sleep like that too? Yes. Figures. Sora always did as he pleased. Whatever we'd be doing together, he'd find a way to slack off. Even trying to leave the islands. I did all the work on the raft by myself. That's it. When this slacker wakes up, I'll tell him off. I told him to take care of Kyrie, and here he is just taking a nap. But I can't chew him out like he deserves. If I've been asleep. <laughs> I don't need my heart locked. I'm ready. I'm gonna fight Ansem. But what if his darkness overtakes you? If that happens, then the darkness will show me the way. 
Yes. That's true. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that you knew I would say that? I didn't know. I hoped. I wanted you to face the darkness. Because you're the one who can. So that's the reason. That's why you came to my rescue inside that light. In the form of Kyrie. When'd you know? I knew when I met you. You and Kyrie smell the same. Look after Sora. And so, Riku has made his choice. He is choosing to fight Ansem head on. Okay, I'm back. I, I just chose to skip all that. Y'all don't really need to uh, constantly keep going back and forth like that. Let's see. I'm not gonna use. Oh. Okay, never mind then. Guess I'll go. Guess, yeah, I'll go ahead and use this. Have myself a little safe area to where I can keep myself safe. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today's episode. Next time on Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. There's only one world card left, and that is. Castle of Libya. So, if you enjoyed today's episode, please share, like, subscribe if you want to, and I'll see you all for the next episode. Have a nice day, and no, I'm not going to fight all those heartlesses, even though I would much rather do that, but I don't want to be too overleveled like I was against, well, again. anyway, I will see you all later.